did you watch the match yesterday? Yeah, I did. It was very good. Hey, Hiroko. Yeah. Are you done? The meeting is going to begin very soon in no time. Oh, okay. I'm coming. <laughs> good morning, guys. Good, good morning. morning. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Hamono. Do you have any idea where the studio? I'm sorry, but I don't know where it is. I must say this place is very confusing. Uh, uh, sorry, I'm in a bit of a hurry. Okay, Bye. goodbye. Have a nice day. This is yours, ma'am. Uh. Thank you, sir. No problem. Never mind. Uh, uh, excuse me, huh? Uh, excuse huh? me! Huh? Excuse huh? me! Hey, Papa! Huh? Good morning! Oh, hi! Good morning! In our school, my classmates call Hiraoka as Hiraba. Sometimes I wonder why he's called by that name. Perhaps Hiraba is cooler than Hiraoka. I have no idea why my classmates call him that. But since everyone calls him by that name, I also call him Hiraba. <laughs> Hiraba, this Friday our class is supposed to enact the in-house school program during the lunch hour. Oh yes, yes. Well, you're right, Maruko. We get this opportunity only once a year. We should definitely put up a good program. You are right. I too want to do something interesting. Oh well, I'm really excited about it, Maruko. Oh, me too. I get excited when I get to know about such things. That's right. Good morning, students. This week your class is supposed to present the in-house school program during the lunch hour. Think of some interesting topics and submit them to me. Yes, yes sir! Well, my dear classmates, Migiva and I are going to take down your ideas. I want each and every one of you to come up with something interesting. Dialogue Everyone, with... please submit your ideas for the in-house school program in tomorrow's council meeting. And then we shall devise a more detailed plan. So everyone try to come up with something new this time. Yes! Hey, Tama-chan, mm -hmm. do you have any idea about the upcoming program? I can't think of anything at this moment. Usually students either sing songs or introduce their classmates during such in-house programs. That's all I know, Maruko. But I really don't find their programs to be interesting. I only wish they were more creative and funny, Tama-chan. Hey, Maruko. Oh, hi there. Why don't we brainstorm together and come up with something interesting? Huh. Would you like to join us? Mm. To begin with, let's have music as our opening act. What do you say? Huh. I feel so too. Why don't we sing a famous singer song? You're right. Well then, let's sing some popular song. After that, maybe we can ask our classmates to come and talk about their failures and achievements. I'm sure that each one of them will come up with something cool. That's interesting. I'll do a good job, guys, if I was to do the comparing. That's a good idea. Maybe you can compare for this in-house program. Yeah, that's right. Maruko's good at conversing with people. Please give me a cool topic to talk about because not good with serious stuff. Hey, Kosugi, you know what? I have an interesting idea for the in-house school program. Okay, what is it? My idea is that we talk about the challenging jobs each one of us is carrying out. Hope you like my idea. What do you say? Uh, go on. Huh? You don't like this idea of mine, Kosugi? Is that all you have to say? What are you saying? Well, I didn't say that your idea was bad, Yamane. You know what? This is all my fault. I should have discussed this idea with someone more encouraging. Yeah, maybe. Hmm. I think a topic like meet the famous people of your town might work. Let's gather information about the famous people of our town. For example, someone like Sasaki Grandpa. You're right. Maybe Sasaki Grandfather can sing a song about the trees. What do you say, Maruko? Oh, wow. That's good. Sounds interesting. You bet. I must say, Hiraba, you really get various new and wonderful ideas. Mm, that's true, you're right. <laughs> when I grow up, I would love to do a job in which I can use my ideas. I'd love to have a job which is challenging. I don't want to settle for something mediocre. But I wonder if such kind of jobs are available, Maruko. I'm sure there might be some. But then what sort of a job would that be? Hmm. hmm. Those who do such kinds of jobs are called broadcasting writers. Broadcasting, broadcasting writers? writers? Hmm? Hmm, 
The broadcasting writers imagine different programs for the media. They write scenes for shows. I think this job is apt for you. You're right, Marco. That's a useful information. How can one become a broadcasting writer? Is there any exam for it? Huh? Actually, I don't know anything about it. Marco, after the song, let's introduce some interesting guys from our class. Oh, yes! Let's see who these interesting guys are. Let us first start with Yamada. <laughs> he always laughs. And then it's our friend, Boo Boo Butaro. And then it's Maru who keeps saying, Let's do it, guys. These guys laugh and scream all the time. And you know what? It's such a big nuisance to the whole how do you like it, Hiraba? That's awesome! I think that is really good! Really? Thank you so much! Now let's think about the next plan. Why don't we enact some of the blunders made by our classmates? Do you remember when Fujiki lost his New Year's gift? Oh yes, that was quite hilarious! Fujiki dropped his New Year's gift and it was picked up by the dude Yamada! And Fujiki paid Yamada 5,000 yen! Actually, Fujiki had promised Yamada that he'd pay half the amount that he earned. And then, with that money, Yamada bought himself a puppet doll. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and then after a few days, Fujiki and I got the same puppet doll. But later, we didn't know what to do with it. <laughs> I think it'll be simply awesome if we enact the story in a school in our program. Oh, uh, really? Huh. It's an interesting concept. Hmm, well let me see Maruko. We have to start collecting information about the famous people of our town. I think we should go down to Sasaki grandfather's place with a tape recorder. Hmm, you have a point. Kids, do you have any work huh? with me? Huh? Sasaki grandpa, we'll be meeting you tomorrow or day after to get some information. Is that okay? Information? Information about me? Yes. yes. We want to gather information about you. It's for our school program called Meet the Famous People, in which we want you to sing a song. Oh, okay, now I get it. I'll be more than happy to do it. You can count on me, kids. Take care. Goodbye. Goodbye. I must say, he's really kind-hearted. Hmm, you're right. Hey, it's commendable that Hirauka had so many different ideas. Yes, apparently he loves to think a lot. I wasn't aware of that. I really wonder how one huh? can become a broadcasting writer. Even I don't know, but somehow it seems to be quite a tough oh, job. That's right. Becoming a broadcasting writer or even a cartoon serial writer is not an easy job. You girls, if you have such plans, give them up right now. Stop! She's right, Hiroshi, that's really bad! Well, it's not right to say stupid things when you're a child. But then tomorrow, when you grow up, you shouldn't be talking such nonsense like this. That's enough, Daddy! I have decided to become a cartoon serial writer! If you wish to be that, then do it. Listen up, Daddy! If I ever become a writer, you'll be a funny character in my show, get it? Oh, really? Is that so? I'm really eagerly looking forward to you becoming a laughing stop of entire Japan. <laughs> You're the meanest daddy ever! Oh, Maruko, my dear, it's my request. Please don't make me the laughing stock of your cereal. Uh -uh. Of course, Grandpa. There's no way. I'll make you a funny character in my show. You're always the best. Oh, I'm so relieved to hear that. Well, Maruko, my dear, you become the scriptwriter of that comedy serial right away. It'll take me nearly 10 years to become the script writer of a comedy show. 10 years? <laughs> ah, thanks for the food. Oh. Oh, I'll be going and taking a shower now. And the story continues. <laughs> Students, <laughs> now go to announce the ideas put forward by y'all for the Ida School program. I want the ones with the ideas to raise their hands. Yes! 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 yes. yes. Okay then, let's start with Maida. I think it would be a good idea if we could talk about our classroom's cleanliness. Okay. Yamane, it's your turn next. My idea for today is how each one of us is working hard to achieve our goals. Okay, Fuyuta, you're next. 
I think singing huh? the classroom anthem would be a good idea. Half our class could sing the anthem while the rest could play the flute and the mouth organ. These ideas don't sound exciting at all. Yeah, you're right. Indeed, they're very boring. Yeah, I guess nobody has any interesting ideas to suggest. Oh God, save us. Do we really have to go through with all this? Please! Hiroka, what do you have to say? Huh? If you ask me, I would like to start the program by singing a famous song. Then I would like to introduce some of the funny and interesting students of our class. Followed by telling everyone about the weird blunders made by our class students. And then under the topic called Meet the Famous People of Our Town, I would like Sasaki Grandfather to sing a song for us. Oh wow, this idea is really good. Yeah, sounds really interesting. <laughs> Please maintain silence in the class. Students, I want you all to give your feedback about the ideas that you all just heard. Starting with you, oh no. I think Hirauka and Maruko's idea is really good. With their ideas, we can put up a good show. I think the same too. I agree with them too. I guess yours and Hirauka's idea is getting popular, Maruko. <laughs> Nervous. I must say, this idea is quite interesting. <laughs> I really like this idea. I totally disagree. I think this idea is no good, guys. Well, it's utter nonsense. We got to take this program very seriously, guys. Yes, that's right. In my opinion, discussing the weird blunders made by our classmates <laughs> is really stupid. I'm totally against playing some popular song during lunch. Hour. And now I don't want to listen to any song sung by Sasaki Grandpa. I think his idea is weird. Do you know what you're talking about? <laughs> According to me, this idea is good. Think about it, guys. It would be so boring to listen to the classroom anthem during the lunch hour. <laughs> hey, this is not funny. <laughs> <laughs> Do you we even know what you're talking yes, about? Yes, yes, that's right. That's not the case, Hamaji. It's really interesting. <laughs> the school lunch hour is a time for enjoyment. So oh this idea God, is really, really interesting. Yeah, yeah, and I like yeah, it very yeah, much. Please hold yeah, up. Please hold up. Yeah, you listen up, to me. You I am right. Okay. Okay. My dear classmates, at this moment it's very difficult to decide whether to take any of our or Hiroka's idea into consideration. So Migiwa and I have come up with this brilliant idea to conduct a voting system. We shall consider the opinion of the majority. Those who feel Hiroka and Maruko's idea is good, please raise your hands. Me! 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 One, two, three, four, five. Uh, uh, uh. 18 of y'all feel that Hiroka's idea is good. Now I would like to know how many of y'all oppose their ideas. Yes. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, uh. 22 of y'all oppose their ideas. Maruko and Hiroka have lost by a small marginal difference. We will be taking Yamani's idea into consideration. A bunch of losers. I don't know why on earth did they support such a boring idea. I do understand what you're saying. It's too bad their ideas weren't taken into consideration. We don't have a choice, right here, Rabba? That's right, but we really can't do much, Maruko. I'm glad you guys are not behaving like spoil sports. Uh-huh. You guys are really cool. Really? Thank you. See you tomorrow, guys. Don't lose heart. Yeah, bye. Bye. bye, -bye. Mm. Oh well, it's very disheartening, you rubber. I know, we put in so much of efforts. It would have been an interesting program. I feel really bad. Hey! Huh? Huh? Hello, Sasaki, Grandpa! <sighs> so have you all got the tape recorder with you all today? I'm very, very excited to sing the song. Sasaki, Grandpa, I'm sorry. Hmm? What happened? Our idea wasn't taken into consideration. We lost by a small marginal difference. Sasaki, Grandfather, we are sorry. We cannot mm. make our classmates listen to your song. Oh. That's really sad. I was really looking forward to this. 
I hope and pray that one day you guys will use my song. I'll be waiting for that day here upon Maruko. Huh? See ya. Hello, Hiraba. Hmm? Tell me, do you still want to think about interesting ideas? Hmm, it really gives me a high. Me too. I want to think about wonderful ideas even when I grow up. Same here. I always want to come up with funny ideas from time to time, Maruko. <laughs> Something very funny to make people laugh. That's right. And you know, I want to write funny and interesting shows. I want to become a broadcasting writer. With my interesting and funny ideas, I want to bring a smile on everyone's face. I want to be known for my work. Hey, Rabba, just imagine when we become adults, how wonderful it'll be if our dreams come true. I wish we could work in the future sometime together. It'll be so much fun. <laughs> Then, after 20 years... Huh? The writer's name is Hiraba! Even I know someone by that name. He was my school friend. Huh? This is from Hiraba! Marco, things are good at my end. I just love your program, Chibi Maruko-chan. Characters like Honami, Hamaji and Kentaro make me feel nostalgic. I'm sure you're surprised to see my letter. After all, it's been so long. I'm working as a broadcasting writer and I love my job. At times, it's quite hectic, but it's a lot of fun. I was wondering if we could do a program together. I'm sure we can come up with something good. I'm planning to come down and meet you sometime at your office. I'm really looking forward to it. Until then, take care. Goodbye. Oh my god, it's an emergency! I need to call up here, Rabba, right away. Hello, this is Hiraoka. Hey, Hiraba! Do you remember me? Oh, if I'm not wrong, it's Maruko. Mm -hmm. You're absolutely right. I got your letter. Thank you so much, Hiraba. Oh, I'm so happy that you received it. I was completely unaware that you're a broadcasting writer. You should have told me a long time back. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Oh, come on. That's okay. I'm sorry to ask you, but would you like to work along with me? Huh? Work with you? Would you like to do the screenplay for Chibi Maruko-chan? Huh? Uh -uh. I, I, I guess it's too early. We should give it some time. Oh, please don't say no. It's a request, Hiraba. I have written the entire story myself. So I guess you want me to write the screenplay. But I'm occupied at the moment. It'll surely take some time. Oh, you can take your time, Hiraba. After all, you were in my class, so... You'll know most of the characters in it. So please, Hiraba, you can do this, please. But even though I was in your class, I must say it's quite a daunting task. Oh, Hiraba, please don't say no. Oh, well. Oh, please, Hiraba. And that was Hiroka, who got completely perplexed because of Maruko, who hadn't even changed a little bit after growing up. Well, after the song, we'll introduce some interesting guys from our class, okay? Oh, yeah. <laughs> she loves everyone She's got dreams and desires in her mind Flying in the sky As she gently reaches for stars That she can Mama loves her, but sets her right rather strictly. Her busy daddy's always there, right behind. And grandpa, oh, so cute. 
that keeps forgetting everything. Oh, her grandma, she's the best there is. But she won't listen to anyone in her family. It's hard to tell her what to eat. Gently reaches for stars that she can.